Well, I think, you know, I'm looking forward to another good team. Um, the polls uh, mean nothing to me. They don't mean anything to me when, you know, we were picked third in our half in 2010 uh, and, uh, and won it. I think we were picked uh, fifth in 2014 when we won it. That's for fans. And uh, being picked second this year, I think that's more respect for our program than it is uh, – you know, anything else, um, you know, we seem to have short memories that uh, we lost three really good players. One of the great scorers uh, of all time here in Carl Cochran, an unbelievable defender, maybe the best defender I've ever coached. Um, another terrific player in Lee Skinner. And then John Swinton that put together a heck of a career for us, could guard multiple positions, never turned the ball over. Um, you know, so we lost, uh, we lost a lot. Having said that, uh, very pleased through eight practices. You know what we have coming back. Uh, we have very good players and great teammates, and uh, we're off to a good start. Looking forward to, uh, to what the future holds. Spencer Collins selected to the all-conference team for preseason. Yeah, yeah. He's one of your returners. What is he going to mean to your team this year? Well, he'll mean, uh, certainly mean a lot, and, and no different than when he came in here, which seems like yesterday, it was three years ago as a, as a rookie. And... Um, you know, he, here's a guy that started every game in his career. He scored, I don't know, 1,200, 1,300 points through, uh, through his junior year. And uh, because of Cochran Skinner, um, it's probably, in my estimation, it's been a quiet 12, 1,300 points, if that's possible. Uh, he's put together a, a, a terrific career, and uh, I'm certain uh, if we can – you know, manage to keep him healthy and puts, you know, other pieces around him that, uh, that we have here in place, he's going to uh, cap a brilliant career with yet another, uh, you know, fine senior season. And lastly, another tough schedule here for the Terriers this year, Missouri, North Carolina, all the way to Harvard. What are we looking forward to this year? Well, looking forward to, you know, day by day. Um, you know, we look forward to scrimmaging next week and seeing uh, you know, somebody in a different jersey. Uh, this is a big part of our season right here. And, um, uh, but, you know, to look ahead uh, just, just for a minute, uh, it is a challenging schedule. That's what we, you know, have always had to do, have done uh, around here. I think it's, you know, I think it's a fair schedule um, based on where we've been and who we are. And we'll challenge uh, this bunch and, uh, continue to get better, and uh, there will be a couple of uh, growth spurts, uh, you know, in that, uh, you know, uh, non-league schedule into uh, into late December before uh, you know our league play begins uh, with uh, with Greensboro J January second or third. So, um, I think I think it's a great schedule. Look forward to looking forward to it.